Um, I'll, I'll be uh, very honest. Um, I, I'm kind of tech savvy when it comes to building websites using Wix. And I had this beautiful looking site and I thought I was done. Well, then I hit, uh, you know, week eight and I had to actually review everything twice because there's so much in there and the amount of information was incredible. I learned that the sites that I've had for a couple of years were basically worthless. Um, that you really need to go um, with everything that's outlined in week eight. That course alone is worth whatever we paid. Um, I now have a nice looking site, but it's fully functional too. So I I took the bait saying Wix, I can drag and drop and it looks beautiful and it, it didn't do what I needed to do from an SEO perspective. So there was a learning curve for me. Um, I can imagine somebody without computer knowledge, but Dr. Meg did put it in layman's terms as best as possible. So that's good. You just have to be focused and don't be afraid to watch that module three or four times because you're going to find nuggets throughout, throughout. So, uh, but follow the process. I jump the gun like I think a lot of breeders do. And Dr. Meg always says, follow the process. Don't jump ahead. It will cost you time and money. It will. So <laughs> if you're not at week eight, don't, don't jump ahead. And this is firsthand experience from somebody who thought I had it done. I did not have it done. So. Thanks for sharing that, Brandon. Yeah, it, look, lots of people jump ahead and um, it's, they does, they, it just wastes so much time and money and having to redo it and then not knowing what was done right, what wasn't done right. So follow the process. It's not that daunting, is it? I mean, I, I know you got to watch oh. it two or three times, but you, all you got to do is fill out the, the worksheet. Don't be scared. Yeah, if you, if you focus, I mean, you can't, yeah, you can't have it going and you're doing something else. You really have to focus on what's being said. And it's it's really it's it's really good. So um, yeah, that would be definitely my my recommendation. Yeah. Thanks, Brandon. Brandon.